What's up guys? It's Coach Jordan back with another Watt at Home Option brought to you by Full Steam CrossFit. Today we have a two part workout for you guys. Part one, we're going to need everyone to break out either a PVC pipe, a broom handle, or if you've got a bar at home, you could use an empty bar for this potentially. Um, but we've got a very high volume skill piece for the snatch. So we're going to work on positions, we're going to be working on tiny little details with your snatch technique to make sure that A, your technique, so your skill with the snatch as far as like where you're putting your body is staying sharp and B, to actually refine it a little bit, maybe even make it better going, over the, going into the next couple of weeks. Uh, so once we're done with that, we're going to jump into a Metcon and today's Metcon is, is a couplet. Uh, we've got two movements, right, a couplet. <laughs> uh, strict pull-ups or renegade rows, it's either or, um, and every time we hit a dash, we're going to do 35 double unders. So the way this works, you have 10 reps of the strict pull-ups or 10 renegade rows each side, and you have 35 double unders. That goes down to 9, then 35, 8 and 35, 7 and 35, 6 and 35, so on and so forth until you get to 1. Once you get to 1, there's no dash after 1, so you're done. Uh, guys, there will be a time cap on that for sure. Go ahead and take a look at the workout on Wattify and we'll, we'll rehash that with you then. And yeah, so it's a fun one. If you need to modify that again, there are several options you can do with single arm row variations. Maybe not quite comfortable holding that position for uh, the renegade rows quite yet. Uh, you can obviously you can do banded pull-ups if that's an option for you at home. If you have rings set up, you could of course do that as well. Um, as far as the double unders are concerned, we can either reduce the reps if you have double unders but are not like a super double under champion, I'd recommend somewhere between 15 and 20 and you can also swap those as straight up for single unders, that would be 35 reps. Now if impact is an option, we of course always have high knees in place. Those are tougher than they look, some people shake their heads at them, but uh, if you're moving like you should be with those renegade rows and you're continuing to be aggressive with them, look at your heart rate up. All right, guys, talk to you soon.